Hey guys, welcome to another video episode of Shout Me Loud and I'm your host Harsh Agrawal. Well, today's video is for all the WordPress users who is looking for a backup solution. So in past few years, a lot of WordPress backup solution is coming online. Considering that 30% of the websites in the world are powered by WordPress, which is a significant number. Now, we all know that WordPress is a complex CMS. Apart from WordPress, it runs on a web server. And if anything goes down and you don't have the backup, you kind of lose all your work. So depending on if you're a blogger or if you're an agency who's maintaining and managing WordPress for their client or a freelancer who's developing WordPress based websites, well, a backup system is something that you must have. And one rule of the backup is you don't store your backup on the same server where your website is because that beats the purpose. So thumb rule is your backup should be offsite on some other server. Maybe it can be Amazon, it could be Dropbox, it could be Google Drive, anywhere as long as it's a recent backup and that you can also use to restore your website. Now, recently I'm looking into the blog vault, which is a GDPR ready WordPress backup system and offered many significant features, which seems very promising. And Apart from backup, they also provide features like it checks for the malware, which is something becoming a real problem with the increased number of cyber attack and spam. So it real time checks your website for any kind of malware in the WordPress theme or plugin and it helps you to take right action. Now we'll get into all those details later on and there's a blog post on Shout Me Loud. You can read that to understand everything about Blog Vault. But in this tutorial, we'll look into how we can configure Blog Vault for a WordPress website and I will also show you an example of a website that I've configured and look at all the features that is possible. So the very first thing you need to do is like just simply go ahead and sign up for an account. They offer seven days free trial where you don't need the credit card I believe. So you can start taking a backup of your WordPress site for free for the first seven days get used to the interface and if you like then you can upgrade to the premium plan all right so here i've added one site but let's start from the scratch let's add a new website and see how the process looks like so once you're inside the dashboard click on add new site so i'll back up this shortmetake.com click on next step and now here's a fun part you can manually install the plugin by going to your dashboard go to plugins add new and install the blog world plugin or you can also let blog world do that for you so let me do that so in this case i'm letting blog vault automatic installer to install blog vault plugin so that should be easy just enter your wordpress username and password here since they are using https uh, you have one less thing to worry about in case if you're very paranoid about this you can actually go ahead and install plugin manually either way it's okay this will work so let's click on install plugin so the first thing that means like it will gather all the information and then it will start taking the backup and you can see here the firewall is enabled by default so blog world team also developed another solution called malcare and they offer both the solution with the blog world so depending on the plan that you need the kind of features you need you can pick up the plan so they have personal business developer agency plan depending on what's your status if you are a blogger you can go for personal plan if you are a business or a you know like somebody who's managing a lot of client website you can take the business plan or agency plan so this would take some time so let's give it a break All right, so here's the report. Now the first backup is completed. Now you can see the file sync was about 287 MB and all the my database table is also sync. So the file sync is like your WP content folder tables are like the tables and you can also test backup by clicking on it and you can see more detail about your backup by clicking on view site details. So let's check out more details. Now one of the features that I really like about blog world is the staging feature which actually gives you the option to you know basically create a replica of your website on a test server and then you can do all kind of testing like try new plugins, edit your themes. And once you're ready, you can make it live. Now, this is a feature which is offered by most of the managed WordPress hosting. But if you're using your own server like DigitalOcean, Walter, or anything else where you don't have the feature for staging, you can always take advantage of Blog World. So anyways, let me take you back. So here's a WordPress tutorial. This is a website which I added earlier and this will give us some more data about what we can expect from the dashboard. So you can see like it has taken 19 backups. We can configure how often the backup should be taken. If you want to move your WordPress site from one hosting to another, you can also do that using the migrate feature. You can click on restore feature to restore your backup to a new server. Now security feature is what I was mentioning earlier. Like it scans your website for any kind of threat. They keep updating their security engine to identify those 
updated thread and that's something which is i think a deal breaker for a lot of people who are managing multiple websites now the firewall feature actually let you check the traffic and login log so let me give you an idea here so you can see here it just shows logs that like okay somebody's trying to log in using brute force attack the attack is from germany russia then you can also click on files or traffic log to see like, how people are accessing your website now many of you may not be using it regularly but sometimes when you're under attack this is going to be very useful you can click on secure site and also secure a certain part of your website now this is a feature that you would not usually expect from a wordpress backup system now imagine if you're taking regular backup but your themes or your plugins are corrupted or you know they are infected with the virus and that goes into your backup for the next 30 days or 50 days and when you try to restore your website you never get rid of those infected file but in this case when the backup is being done while scanning your theme and plugins to find the infected file actually your backup is more secure and it's actually more useful so this kind of features are something that you won't see anywhere else now here you can see the staging site which i was mentioning about just clicking on this will take me to the staging site which is basically a replica of my original site and i can also log in here and make some changes now this is not going to be indexed so there is no problem of duplicate content think of this as a playground of your life site a replica where you can do anything you like whatever changes you want to make you make it on your staging site once you are ready once you feel like hey this is worth it then you make the same changes on the live site and here is a overview of how many users features are i think the most important thing that you need to configure and the only thing that you should definitely configure is when do you want the sync to happen how many times the backup should be taken and overall it's a very powerful engine it's, they are constantly developing and adding new features which will ensure that your backup actually works since the team is backed up by people who really understand the security and really concern about the user's data because even if one particular user doesn't have their backup properly it means losing the website which means losing your revenue so whenever you are considering any backup system the first thing you need to ensure that the integrity of data backup is there and that's something you get with the plug world now from the pricing point of view i would not say that it's one of the cheapest one out there the personal plan cost about 89 dollar a year depending on the number of website you want you can always pick a plan according to you so from the pricing point of view it's definitely on the high end but again the kind of service they are offering like one click restore one click staging site backup validation and you know also the wordpress management features i think it's totally worth it considering they are also gdpr compliant which is actually a big deal for anybody who's serving traffic to european nation this is going to be very helpful well that's how you add a website to blog world you start taking backup and then you can forget about everything else as in at least about the security well that's how the blog world works i understand you may have some question about the wordpress backup feel free to ask me in the comment section below also check out the blog post i will add the link in the description so you'll get an idea that what all you get with blog world well with this i will see you in the next video if you like this video do like and subscribe to my channel for more wordpress related update bye bye this is harsh